Hello, Zebra Herd. Welcome back to Mario Kart Super Circuit. Today, we are heading back into the 50cc action. This time, it is going to be with another character. Should be Toad, same character type as Peach. So, all speed, very little weight. <laughs> he is sort of shaking his head all over the place. I hope he's okay. Um, better be wearing a seatbelt there, Toad. But yeah, we are moving on, not to the Lightning Cup, but to the Star Cup. And there's also the... the special cup as well. I don't know if we unlock that for 50cc, we'll have to wait and see, but for the Star Cup, there's Snowland, Ribbon Road, Yoshi Desert, and Bowser Castle 3. Really, Ribbon Road is from this game? I thought that was a new track in Mario Kart 8's DLC. Huh, the more you know. This this game, for being pretty restricted with being a Game Boy game, has a lot of like out there ideas that sort of seem to carry on with the other Mario Kart games really well. Anyways, we had a decent like start there, but unfortunately we got knocked around because we're very lightweight. It's very icy right now. Let's get rid of Peach if we can. That hit Yoshi instead, okay? Get these coins quickly. Hey, move it. It's very hard to stay in a straight line on a track like this, so. Excuse me. Oh no, oh no. Yeah, I'm definitely just trying to get out ahead for right now. It's not working out the best. Oh, but I got a nice drift out of that, so let's go jump over that. Oh, that was definitely a bit of a tight turn. But I guess there's like a sort of like a different path to go down there. This is a little bit of a weird track so far, but come on, let's just catch up for now. That's it, slowly trying to overtake everybody. Okay, second lap, and we're in the lead. Keeping this banana by my side for right now. Oh, so yeah, there's like a sort of a wider path there. Weird, why would I wanna do that? That seems like it would be much slower. And there was some extra items on the inside turn there. That's sort of the thing, lots of different stuff going on, but a lot of it is hard to access because of how hard it is to control. Ah, okay, okay, I thought that was like deep water, but I, I ran over that just fine. Weird. Anyways, we'll get our triple green shell. Still in the lead for now. Princess Peach is trying to change that, but not on my watch. Okay, apparently we got a big U-turn coming in. It's not really that big of a U-turn, but okay. Come on, come on. So I'm not really trying too many of the shortcuts here. I'm sorry, but I just need to keep in the lead because Princess Peach isn't too far behind. Maybe I'll throw some of those around. Oh, maybe there was sort of a shortcut there. Hard to tell. Anyways, for right now. Yeah, really hard to tell. But we'll just keep going for now. Ah, no, 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 no! Oh boy, come on, come on. We gotta get, get a win on the first race. There we go. So we're able to keep ahead of Peach and Luigi, who are in second and third. Not too bad. So that was our two minute race time. Pretty good to see that. Definitely could get that under two minutes though, especially in the higher difficulties, because we'll have faster carts, but it's tough so far. We'll see how it goes here in Ribbon Road. Yeah, there's a presence and everything. This is a really cool looking track. All right. Didn't get the good start I got before, but I'm working on it. That's not good. Need to stay off the, uh, the off-road parts if I can. Okay, so so far I'm still staying ahead. I didn't hit anybody with that. I just want to try to learn the whoa, the track as much as possible this race, or this lap. So that next lap, I can get to doing some more proper drifts and everything, I would hope. Whoa. Okay, Princess Peach, not happening, out of my way. Oh, I missed my item. Not good. Okay, got a bit of a zigzag, and boom, the first lap is finished. Okay, I gotta stop doing that. Save it for the U-turns, just like that. This is another U-turn, and that got me that speed boost I was looking for, so I feel like I'm starting to figure out, starting to figure out which uh, turns I should do that with and which ones I should not. And for the ones that I can't, I, doing that sort of jumping turn seems to work out quite well as well. Oh gosh. Okay. And there we go, so far so good. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> so we're keeping the lead for right now. Princess Peach is really still trying to take my win though. Oh, I didn't get the drift boost that time. Oh 
Okay, come on, come on, come on. Coming up on the end soon. Uh. Wow, wow. Not too bad. Uh-oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Princess Peach is still right behind me, I gotta keep going. <laughs> that track is really long, actually. That one, no, it was still two minutes and four seconds, so actually not too bad. About the same length as the last one, only a couple more seconds longer. It felt like so much more, though. <laughs> so there we go, race number two done in this cup. So far, a very interesting cup for sure. All right, now time for track number three. It is Yoshi Desert. Look at the giant Yoshi statue in the background. Very cool, and the pyramids, of course, it's supposed to be like an Egypt kind of thing. So yeah, doing that very late seems to be the best bet, which is definitely different than some of the other Mario Karts. You really gotta rev up in some of them. But I guess, you know, that's the fun thing is that every game's a little different. Whoa, okay. Going all over the place right now. Got an item there, that's good. So I'm just trying to figure out this track while I'm using all these mushrooms and stuff. Could be a bit tough. Here we go, that was a good U-turn. Not quite a speed boost from it. And the track definitely is very slippery. Oh, you know what, there's definitely a better way to take that, for sure. Oh, for sure, definitely. Okay, so I'll have to look into that. Because it might be worth my while. But I guess because it's all sandy and stuff, the track is very, very slippery. Okay, not too bad. Got a couple more coins there. Oh no, watch it. The Toad is, you know, pretty cool so far. You know, very similar to Princess Peach, but they're both fun characters to play as. I think I prefer the Mario and Luigi stats so far, but we'll have to try out all the characters and really see, because in Mario Kart 64, it was basically heavy characters all the way. Oh no, you can't. No, I got ate up by the quicksand. Okay, I thought there was maybe like a little place you could sneak in on the side there, but I suppose not. If you had a speed boost, maybe you can make that jump down. If you had a mushroom. Anyways, throw that there. It's the final lap. I got rid of Luigi's uh, green shell, at the least. And now, we're elbow to elbow. Trying to see who's gonna win this one. It's a red shell. Threw it at Luigi there. <laughs> come on, come on. Okay, pretty good jump. Oh no, oh no. I apparently got a speed boost there. Weird. Come on, keep at it, keep at it. But that one wasn't a speed boost, huh? Interesting. Go across that little gap, and we're good. Not too bad then. So it seems like on average, the tracks are about two minutes in 50cc. That was a fun track though, for sure. Definitely needs some extra learning. Uh, it seems like it just has a lot of nuance to it. But there we go, a win in every race so far. Let's see if we can't continue that in the final race of today. Bowser's Castle 3. How many castles does this guy have? <laughs> Guess we're gonna find out. So that was definitely a bit too late though. There's a balance for sure. And we'll figure that balance out eventually. Yeah, a lot of the Bowser Castle levels, while they are different, oh no, can sometimes feel the same. So I'm trying to, you know, figure that out as we go along here. Oh boy. So now we're back in fifth. Definitely not good. Oh gosh. Okay, that could have been a lot worse. It's a big U-turn this way. Gonna throw that red shell at you. We're starting to catch up. Remember, we have a really high speed. So naturally, we should be able to catch up with them much more easily, especially with some red shells to pelt at them. Uh, Luigi, you're in trouble now. Did I not get you? Also, there was a uh, Magic Koopa flying around. Oh no, oh no. Ooh. Wow, gotta be careful. Okay, so after, oh, poor Princess Peach gets knocked out. We, we can just keep going. I'm sure there's a way to make this jump so that you don't have to go all the way down and then you turn and then go all the way back. There has to be a better way to do that. Oh, I thought I jumped in time. Hard to tell, of course, once again. It's a 2D game. That was just really silly. I had a lead in everything, and I just did that. I thought I saw a blue shell in the in the, the rollout there. I really hope I did, because that means that there's a, there's a blue shell in the game. Oh no, oh no. I was hoping I could hit Luigi with that one. But not quite. So let's just try to play it safe and keep this lead. We can definitely do that, right? I'd hope so. 
There's definitely a lot of, oh no, the thwomp, the thwomp, the thwomp, no! Oh, the thwomps are the worst. Come on, keep it going, keep it going. We're in fourth place now, but we can most certainly catch up. Ready, set, drift. Really nice drift. Got a speed boost from it. Drift again. Don't go too crazy with it though, just trying to catch up. We're coming up on that finish line quite quickly though. We have a couple more straightaways left to go. Throw out the red shell. Gonna hit Mario. Come on, Princess Peach. Not gonna let you win this one. I don't have any items to throw at you though, so it just had to be purely speed, so there's no way. So it looks like yet again, three first and a second. I think the same thing happened with Princess Peach, didn't it? Tough, tough track for sure, but very fun track as well. I think that we could make some good things happen there if I continue to learn it and you know just get more used to the controls. But there we go, another cup done in 50cc. This time it was a win with Toad. Definitely, it's tough at 50cc even, but I think there's definitely, I can see my room for improvement and I'll try to apply that at 100cc. But for right now, Toad wins, followed by Princess Peach, followed by Luigi. Okay, well good job everybody. Unfortunately, it's a C ranking again. Not so happy to see that. But, we'll keep going for now. And I mean, well actually, that's all we're gonna do in today's episode, but I do wanna see real quick, did that unlock the special cup for us? Indeed it did, so next episode, we'll be doing the 50cc special cup. That should be a lot of fun. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Mario Kart Super Circuit. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.